Darkest of the night Old love and we boot up First love, nothing new Cause got your back, I promise that You know you my best friend We gon' make that money Run it up together, baby We winning I, 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 I'm gonna love you right Right I know What's good, SD gang? It's your boy, Sean It's your girl, Dez and we are back with another lit video! Now today's video is highly requested and it is different. You guys have been spamming up me and my love DMs requesting for cooking vlogs. So you guys, we are going to be doing cooking with Shy and Diz. Yes, and like Shy said, we have been getting so many requests to get this started for you guys. So we are definitely going to make this a segment just so you guys can see what we are in the kitchen cooking up and how we do it. That's right. So today's video is going to be cooking with Shy and Diz because your boy hungry. Your boy <laughs> can use some food right now. So today is the perfect opportunity to go ahead and knock out and bang out a cooking vlog with Sean and Dave. Now, you guys, it is super early right now. What time is it, babe? I think it's 9.39. 9.39, y'all. Tell us, is this a late breakfast or an early breakfast to y'all? I what think you it's think? like a perfect time for breakfast. Like, I don't think uh, it's yeah. too late and it's not it's too It's like early. right in the middle, right? Right, I right. I agree, babe. So, you guys, we have so much in store for this little cooking vlog. But before we get into this video, make sure y'all give this video a fat, fat thumbs up. Make sure y'all subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, because y'all already know. If you haven't subscribed to Team Shy Dez, then you, you ain't lit. Also, you guys, make sure you smack that post notification bell. Make sure it's set to all, because you, 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 you want to be notified every time we draw. And you know that. And you know that. Also, you guys, please make sure you follow me. And my baby on all social media platforms. You can follow me on Instagram. That's at shotgreen underscore. And don't forget to follow me on IG at underscore Dez Janae. Also, you guys, make sure you spam up our TikTok at official shot and Dez. And go ahead and run up the numbers on Facebook as well. Show us some love at shot and Dez. So, SD game, we have an arrangement of deliciousness right here on our island. Babe, go ahead and tell our team shot that's SD game. What we scrambling up? What we whooping up in the kitchen, babe? So, you guys, first, let me say, Cooking breakfast is my favorite like meal. I feel like I make the best breakfast. I do I like breakfast too, babe, but it is not my favorite meal. For some reason, like I can honestly skip out on breakfast. Like I really have to be in the mood for it, but when I'm in the mood for it and I get that flavor this busting down, hold on, wait. When I get that, <laughs> when I get that flavor on these taste buds, man, that breakfast will be hitting different, man. Especially like a long night out, you know what oh. I'm saying? At the club, man, at the strip club with your boys. What? <laughs> man, you know what I'm saying? When you leave the club, you know what I'm saying? And then the next morning, man, that breakfast be hitting different. You cannot lie. I Don't mean, count. yeah, I can agree with that. <laughs> so, you guys, today on the menu, we have grits, mm. sausage. And y'all, not just regular grits, cheese grits. Oh, excuse oh. Me. Cheese grits, you right. Cheese they grits. love some cheese grits. Love and it's it. crazy because used to didn't like cheese grits. I was always like, Ew. And tell your man me. Kind of. For real? I guess. Oh I'm my God, I feel, I feel honored, SD <laughs> game. And then you guys, we have eggs here. And then I'm gonna yep. put together like a little bit of fruit, some grapes and strawberries. So you guys, I do just want to put out here, babe. What's up? Okay, so we have this sausage here, right? Yeah. But this is not my favorite cooking sausage. I love that sausage. And now you make it really good. But I make that junk with breakfast sandwiches and all types of stuff, babe. You do that sausage perfect. But me, I don't know if y'all know this, but there is this sausage in the red pack. Remember the, the red pack sausage, red? The red pack. Are you talking about red hot sausage? I don't know. I don't think it's red hot. I think it's is a it different spicy? one. No, it's not spicy. Oh, I don't know. It's in like a white and red pack. I'm going to find it and I'm going to make sure y'all see. That is the sausage I be cooking. We'll put it right here. I love that sausage. But I will say another thing you put me on is this sausage. So this is some good sausage, but you gotta make this baby. Bet. And you guys, leave a comment down below. What is your favorite freaking hot breakfast tipple mm. fare? I think 
think for me, this is really my favorite hot breakfast. Like, I'm not gonna lie, some cheese grits, some sausage, and some fruit. Now, baby, also, she skipped over my eggs. Nobody in SD Game House like eggs but your boy. I love me some scrambled eggs with cheese. Now, I don't go over the top, you know what I'm saying? I'm not, I don't OD on the eggs. Like, I don't like all the omelets and stuff like that. I can't get into that. I had some boys or whatever in college in the Navy that love freaking omelets, but I could never get into that when we was at the calf, man. But I can go ahead and bust down some scrambled eggs with cheese. Yeah, I feel like I gotta be in the mood to wanna eat eggs. I can't do it all the time. So, normally, Normally, only they getting the eggs in the house. Not nobody else. Nobody else want no eggs. So, Team Sade is Instagram right now. If you still watching this video, make sure you give this video a fat thumbs up. Share this video with a friend or family, you guys. We about to go ahead and get into this cooking session so y'all can see how we prepare our breakfast. Let's get it. Get lit. So Team Shadez, it's the game. Babe over here getting her uh, water boiling for the grits getting that started. I'm about to go ahead and chop up this sausage. What I like to do, Team Shadez, it's the game. I literally like to boil the freaking sausage first, and then I go back and I put it on the frying pan. I don't know why it just tastes better like that, babe. You agree? I agree. It definitely tastes better, but I never had heard of it. Like I didn't know. That <laughs> but babe like liked it when I cook it that way. Bomb. That's why she want me to cook it now. Bomb, y'all. It'd be so bomb. And then I'm getting the water boiling and ready for the grits. Y'all, if y'all didn't already know, make sure you put a little bit of salt in your water when you're boiling it. That just make it boil faster. Fast. And it started. And I feel like it does Fast. add a little bit of flavor before you start cooking. And then you guys, clearly I'm obsessed with like organizing and everything. So this is where we keep our little grits. It keeps them like super fresh. So I love this little thing. It's very convenient. Of course, you know, it's still just your regular, I think it's Quaker Oats grits. It is Quaker Oats. So boom. This is what we use for our grits. And I'm just gonna let Hold on, up. they got they got other brands other than Quaker? I never seen it. I feel like they have like, you know, if you go to like Walmart, you can get like the Walmart great value, whatever oh, it is. Oh, maybe I just wasn't looking hard enough. Probably. Yeah, because I feel like, you know, when you go in the store, you automatically go on for what you know. Sometimes I do try other little stuff, but Stuff like that, like grit, cereal, and stuff. I'ma just stick to what I know. All right, you guys, so I'm about to go ahead and chop up some of this Hillshire turkey sausage, man. I'm about to go ahead and get into this game. So, like I mentioned, I usually just start right here, as you can see, cut right down the centerpiece, and I go around this way, chop it up. I usually like to do it into three even pieces on each side. And y'all going to see what else I do next. But then after that, I just go ahead and I put it into my water right over there. So I didn't put any salt in it. They got the salt sitting over here. I also like to put salt in my water as well. I don't know. It just make it, for, to me, it just make it taste better, honestly speaking. So I'm going to put this in here. Know what I'm saying? And I'm going to honestly, I'm going to let that boil for about 10 to, 10 to 12 minutes. And then after that, you guys will move on to the next thing and you guys will see how I fry up my sausage. You did. All right, you guys. So while my water is boiling for the grits and while the sausage is boiling, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to wash off the fruit. And I'm going to go ahead and I think I'm going to cut up the strawberries too, just so I can make a little fruit mix for us. So we're going to do that. A oh, fruit mix? Are you trying yes, to get fancy? Babe. So this, spam the comments. Y'all let me know just two pieces of fruit. Does that qualify for a fruit salad y'all let me know so is this considered a fruit salad or no uh, like you was go to the grocery store and you was go to the fruit section and where they have all the mixed fruit refrigerated that on the label doesn't say uh fruit salad so every time i get like the strawberry and grape mix it just says mix like a mix. strawberry and grape okay. mix so i don't yeah. think it's a fruit salad and honestly i don't even really think i like fruit salad just because to me when it's all those like different fruits mixed up together it's like the taste be kind of off sometimes so right. i'm not a super fan so it's the game we always rinse off every freaking thing you know what i'm saying that fruit has been in the grocery store you don't know who's been touching it picking over it or any of that man so we always make sure we put sanitization first Yes, so I just give it a quick little rinse in cold water. Now I know sometimes people like to like soak their strawberries and everything, but for the time, I'm just gonna rinse it off, make sure like nothing is really on here. You need me to cut some up for you guys? Yes, babe, you wanna go ahead and cut up the strawberries, that'll be perfect. And your water's starting to boil over there too, just a heads up. Okay. 
so I'm gonna just rinse off all of these strawberries and then while Bae is cutting up the fruit, I'll How you want me to cut it? You just want me to put it in a regular slices or what's up? Um, I'm behind wanna, it, it's not big. Okay. If you want to just cut like the top off. Just the top? And then slice it down the middle. Okay. Bae, what's your favorite fruit? Say grapes. I have always I been a fan it. of grapes. I can eat like a regular whole grapes or candied grapes. Oh my god, they really? Um, I'm gonna say regular grapes. Now I'm not gonna lie, I do love candy grapes, but I'm gonna say regular grapes because I can really like eat a whole bag of grapes by myself. Candy grapes, especially when we have embraces, like sometimes I be struggling, but. I make it work though, cause I do like some candy grapes. Babe, I ain't gonna lie. What, babe? Somebody gonna be short. Why? You uh, eating the strawberries? I, I can't resist, baby. Oh my god. They like hella juicy. Let me see. Oh, you can add other half. Bussing, right? You pick these up at the perfect time. I'm not gonna lie. What's up? There is a special art to cooking grits, and you gotta stay on them. No, for real, for real, like, y'all. Straight facts, because some people will be messing up grits, man, and then she don't never really mess up. But I think it's all in repetition on how much you cook grits, though, because you can lose the touch. It right. has happened to me before, for sure. And you guys, my secret to cooking my grits, What's and that? I don't know if this works for everybody. What's that? Because you didn't even share that with me. Oh, oh babe, I haven't told you. My That's cool. Secret. Okay. You was waiting for the vlog. The vlog. I had vlog. to. I had to give the people something. So my secret for cooking grits, you guys, and making them like perfect, the perfect consistency, the perfect taste, is I let them boil, right? Mm -hmm. But I don't let them overcook. So I am the person that's standing watching my grits. I know some people know how to cook grits where they can walk away. That's I'm not me. doing it. I'm not doing that because I feel like they mess it up. Y'all, she takes so much pride. I mean, the point is not for you. Oh, Lord. But, babe, she takes so much pride, man, in cooking them grits, y'all. I don't play about my she grits, y'all. And another secret is I take them on and off of the heat. So I don't leave them. Yeah, on. I don't do that. I never did that. Y'all leave a comment down below if y'all know somebody that cook uh, grits like this or if you cook grits like this. And I think it helps with like them getting thicker, but then not getting like chunky where they're overcooked, you guys. So babe, I cut up all your strawberries for you. What you need me to help you with now? Thank you. If you want to, since the um since the sausage is not done, if you want to rinse off the grapes too, that'll be perfect. Okay, but what bowl? What bowl are you trying to put them in? Um, I think you can get the bigger white bowl if it's up there. Because we can just put it all in there. Okay. Oh, so it's about to be a lot of food, man. So you guys, my grits are looking perfect. Now, while they're still boiling, I do like to go ahead and like season them up. So I'll put some butter, salt and pepper and then i actually save my cheese till last when i'm taking it off the heat so it can kind of melt but not burn at the bottom of the pan babe have you ever been popped by grits i have but i eat it like a champ though oh my god know. that is my i used to always here. get popped by grease but i i don't know i ain't been getting popped by grease like that granted i haven't been cooking with grease in a minute though now i'm not gonna lie y'all me and cooking. Right here. Oh yeah, that's perfect. Me and cooking, we had like a love hate relationship because I was like that kid. I wasn't cooking nothing. I'm not getting in the kitchen. I was too scared. I was always really? scared of frying. I never, ever, ever, ever fried anything. But then she got with your boy. And she knew she had to come with the cooking, the chef, and you know what I'm saying. And you guys, Desi when I Curry. say I was freaking frightened the first time I cooked anything, I think the first time, the first thing I fried was like chicken. Mm -hmm. And you guys, it was like yo, I cannot fry chicken for nothing, babe. You've been telling me you're gonna teach me how to fry chicken. Babe, some of my secrets I gotta keep to myself. Babe, you never we in know. the same household. What are you talking babe, about? Babe, you never know. I might have to do like a cooking competition against you, and I don't want you to beat me in my own. Y'all let sport. me know if y'all want a cooking competition. I'm babe, winning. Hold on, babe. You better let the people know I really get down. I'm really a beast. I'm really a fool in this kitchen. No, I'm not gonna lie, you Hell, can't cook. Kitchen. But I don't think you can cook better than me. I know, man. No. Let's be serious, man. No, man. We, like, we ain't gonna make this no debate, no argument, debate here on our cooking vlog. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Because it ain't about that. 
Okay, okay so Team Shy Dev, y'all got to say so. If y'all want to see a cooking competition between me and Shy and watch me beat him in cooking, let us know. Also, you guys, if you are new to a Team Shy Dev's SD game, Stop right now. It, it takes nothing. It's totally, completely free. Make sure you guys hit that big bright red subscribe button and subscribe to Team Shot Dance because on this channel, we guarantee you guys nothing but lit quality content on the freaking daily, man. We're on the road to 100K, man. Go ahead, get us there quick, fast, and hurry by sharing our content with your friends and family. Also, you guys hit that big, big, big fat thumbs up button because you know what? We will greatly appreciate it. So Bay over here, he got this fruit looking real scrumptious, you guys. Mm -hmm. Looking perfect. So I just need to put this in the refrigerator for yeah, chilling. Yeah, that's going to cover with foil. No, you're good. Cause you we, sure? I mean, we have to eat it, so it's fine. Okay. And then you guys, I just want to let y'all know, like, why you cooking grits? If you feel like it's not perfect, I always say tweak it then so that it's perfect for when everybody goes to eat it. So I am gonna add a little smidget, like a tiny smidget of water, hot water. This sausage is taking forever, ever. And I'm just gonna put it back on the heat, and then I'm gonna go ahead and season it like I told you guys. So, babe, when you gonna put the cheese in the grits for the people? So I put my cheese in my let grits last, you guys. After I'm taking it off the heat, yes. Okay. After so I you don't let it marinate. No, because it melts. So, so like, it's gonna instantly marinate. Right, and we okay, have a man. gas stove, so anything you put on here, like it's cooking super duper fast, and I love that about a gas stove. Y'all, we love this gas stove, man. It get the job done. Fast. It's so freaking convenient, and it's easy to clean up afterwards, man. I love this gas yes. stove, man. For show that. So I always just put like my cheese and everything on last. Oh wait, man, hold that thought. What about the butter? So yeah, you like, need to put the butter in there, babe. So you guys, I put my butter and my salt and pepper in now. So that, oh, that kind of no, I haven't done it yet. So if you want to grab the butter, that's perfect. Yes, sir. And then I'll grab the pepper. So you guys, look at this consistency. Like these grits are perfect. They're not super duper thick. They're not runny at all, you guys. This is how we love our grits. Yes, sir. I've already put the butter, the salt and pepper in, so they're really seasoned. So if you're not a cheese grit fan, I would just recommend going ahead and taking your grits out now. So y'all already know it's next, but we about to put that cheese in that thing, about to make it cheese, understand me? Cause yes. I'm a fool for that cheese. All right, you guys, so it looks like these sausages back here, they taking a little while to boil. Nah, so. they ready, they better come up with the water. Oh, look, see, he the expert. I don't know nothing about them sausages. So, while he is fixing the sausage and getting ready to fry it up, I'm gonna go ahead and add our cheese to our grits. Now, I personally love cheddar cheese in my grits. I don't know, like, do people use any other cheese in grits? Is it just cheddar cheese? I don't American. Know. Oh, okay. They use American at the Waffle House. Really? I thought that was cheddar cheese, but they, they literally smack a freaking slice of American cheese and they put it on your grits and cheese. Oh my gosh. Okay, so we are gonna use cheddar cheese. Now I have a question for the people and I need y'all to comment in the comment section down below. Do y'all put sugar in y'all grits? Hell no. Nah. Nothing against people that do do that, but I don't like nothing sweet and nothing that's supposed to be like salty like in my grits or my spaghetti. Like I got some family members that put like sugar in both, man. Now, I'm not gonna lie, my grandma, as a kid, she did put like a hint of sugar in her spaghetti. For real? And it always made it taste amazing. But me, I don't really do that and I'm definitely not putting no sugar in my freaking grits. But you know, that they was raised there for them folks. Right, right, they'll eat anything for real for real and make it taste good you guys but i just can't go for it i just can't do it so i already told y'all it's nothing but butter salt pepper and cheese nothing else so y'all i'm getting this frying pan together man to go ahead and fry some of this sausage man because your boy is getting hungry man I and this food fine. gotta get done now at this point i wish y'all could smell in here as soon as he put that freaking sausage in, it smells oh, amazing. Oh yeah, the aroma of whole vibe. So my cheese is now in the grits and I'm just gonna put the top back on. I turned the heat actually all the way off because my grits are already done. I turned the heat off and I'm just gonna leave it on the stove, put the top back on the grits and let the cheese kind of melt so that I can stir it and mix it all up. Now, the only thing we have left is Bay's eggs. And that's gonna be super, super quick. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna whip the that eggs up. Quick. 
And then once the sausages are close to done, then we'll go ahead and fry the eggs up real quick, scramble those up. Now you guys, what do y'all do? Like, I feel like for me, to make my whole cooking experience way easier is I like to clean as I go. I know so, some people. I don't like when people like stuff pile up. Yeah, like. I feel like that's just too much because you know, after you done ate, you full. Some people really not trying to get up and clean. So I always go ahead and kind of like tidy up everything that I'm not gonna use anymore. Put it away, wash whatever dishes that I have out and that I've already used. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that before I get the eggs fresh. Guys, so my sausage is currently frying. And right now, currently, I have the stove top set on medium for these sausages, man. Dad's got the cheese. Look at that, melting on that grits, man. So, we're going to get back with y'all once the food is done and we get our plating going on. Babe, you know what? What? I want you to stand right here, okay? Stay right here and face the camera. Don't ask no questions, babe. Okay, babe, my butter gonna burn from my head. Okay, babe. Babe, I need you to close your eyes, okay? I got a surprise for you. Babe, what You've are you doing? You've been working so hard. And I just wanna show her Team Shades S game my appreciation, my love, and affection for my woman. Babe. For her working so freaking <laughs> hard and her always holding me down, being there, supporting, you know what I'm saying? Our dreams and our goals. Give me a kiss. Stay right there. Look at SDK. I'll be right back, y'all. Oh my gosh, I'm nervous. <laughs> y'all, what do we got? Don't let him prank me, y'all, neither. Like, now I've been in the jail, you know what I'm saying? But this thing a little bit heavy. Heavy? Yep. So turn around, babe. You can take the blindfold off. Look what your man got you. You been yes. talking about this. Yes. Tell her how much you been talking about this. Yo! Now, I didn't get the pink one and the reddish one because I seen this in person at the Apple store and it looks better in person. It actually looks gold. Babe. What's up? He Are you pranking? Yo, he not pranking no. me, babe. Come on. Babe, when did you get this and where was you hot? I'm this not day? telling. Y'all, oh my God. In the I trunk have... of my car is where it's been at, babe, uh, this whole time. Y'all do not know how long I have been talking about getting this Anybody freaking got bag. got mag dog. When I tell y'all this. And this is the big one, babe, this is the big one. It's not the little kid one. This is not the little boy. Oh. We got, I got this junk hooked up for you. Babe. All the specs. I love you. Oh my God. Y'all, look at the back. I'm telling y'all, I know this yes, thing about the Yes, sir. Boy. Yes, sir, babe. Videos, y'all, I'm telling y'all, about to be on a whole nother lit. level. Content about to be crazy. As if it already went lit crazy before, but it's only up. Babe, Blast give me off. a kiss. Babe. Oh, my I mean, God. For you. you work so hard. You hold a house down, you know what I'm saying? And you know what I'm saying? You the best woman a man can ask for. You know what I'm Thank saying? Thank you, man. Not only do you support me and love me, y'all, but you stroke my ego. You motivate me to keep pushing hard whenever times has been rough for me. And you always see the light at the end of the tunnel saying, keep going, babe. Keep going strong. Keep working hard, man. And I just want to say, babe, I love you and I appreciate you. Not trying to make this no teary eye moment, but y'all. I had to go ahead and I had to show out for my lady. I love you, babe. Love Thank you, y'all. I am super freaking excited. I ain't even hungry no more. Like, I'm trying to get on this mat. I ain't even worried about breakfast no more. Like, I'm about to go ahead and get this set up. Oh my God, I'm so in love. She's so pretty and, oh my God. She? Yeah, How long? I uh, it's yours. This is she, you, babe. What's her name? What am I call? I think I'm gonna call her Daisy. Daisy? Daisy. I'll, I'll rock with that. So Team Shades Instigate, I hope y'all enjoyed cooking with Shad and Des with a little twist added to it, babe. Babe, you did Did I show out y'all or did I show out? You did Y'all spam it. the comments if your boy showed out for my lady. You definitely did that. I promise you. I promise you you did that. Babe. Time to go to work. We about to go to work, man. I'm glad we got this in our household. And I just know, man, this is going to 
This was an investment for my woman. What more can I say? Hey, I just want to say thank you so much. I really do appreciate this. I am no, super you freaking much excited. It. I, I am super you. excited to get started working on this, getting that content out for you guys. Yes, love. So just stay tuned because it's only up from here. You That's guys. right, you guys. Thank you guys for watching this video to its full and tired. Make sure you give this video a fat, fat thumbs up. Subscribe to Team Shot This. It's the game because if you ain't, you ain't late. Also, you guys make sure that post notification bell set to all because you, you, you want to be notified every time we drop. Also, you guys wait, hold that thought. And today's post notification shout goes to Barbie Paris. We greatly do appreciate the support. We thank you guys for rocking with us. We about to get up out of here. I love you guys. I love you guys. We love you guys. And to further do further notes, we're gonna see y'all in the next lit video. And you know that. Up and we pulled up. First love, nothing new, cuz got your back. I promise that you know you my best friend. We gon' make that money, run it up together, baby.